tell y'all now I went cargo crazy okay hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is Jaya but you can call me Holly J and as you can tell by the title we are back at it what I got at Ross for a hundred dollars yes and this time I actually have the receipt because sometimes I do not be having my receipt uh you know make sure I say the little prices and whatnot and we can keep a little money count let's keep a money count but yeah we're not about to take too much time with this intro you already know what it is if you want to see what I got from Ross for $100, keep watching. Oh, and yes, we will be styling outfits for what I have. We're going to be styling what I can. I try to do everything, but I can't do everything, you know? So just stay tuned. Follow me like on TikTok. Watch my shorts. You might see the pieces style in those videos, but for this video, we're going to style what we can. And make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Leave me a comment. I want to talk to y'all. I want to know what you like. You know, what outfit, what, you know, just talk to the girl, you know? All right, so as I mentioned, I went cargo crazy, but I'm just, like, geeked at what Ross had this time. Like, I'm geeked. What I am noticing, though, when I'm out and I do shop, I am not finding cute shirts like I've been very like I've been doing really well on the pants and cool pants and that's something really dear to my heart I love a cool pant it's so easy to style something basic or just clean cut on the top and then the pants have so much character but I am having a hard time finding tops because I mean I can't just wear pants but neither here nor there we went cargo crazy but like girl Ross with the car they going stupid like it really shocked me I had no idea I do just want to say I did pick up something that took me out of the hundred dollar bracket but that's just goes to show what Ross can do and you can find and so we're not gonna include that in my money count but I am gonna show it to y'all because it's really freaking cute but we'll save that for later the first thing I got here um, I did get one shirt, so it's this white long sleeve shirt. Yes, I know what we're doing with long sleeves, but hey, you're not just always in the sun all the time. You know what I'm saying? So it's super cute with this detail in the front that like latches, um, just like very subtly but sexy, cute, um, and character to the shirt across the chest. I really like that, and then it's kind of like this it's one of those it's that fat it's kind of heavy this ribbed fabric but it's not cotton for sure so it definitely will make you a little warm i'm sure let's see what is it made out of ah 100 percent polyester yeah i mean it's ross we're talking about i don't always get tops from ross y'all know i find cool pants i find jumpsuits i find outerwear accessories stuff like that like it, it, it just is what it is so this time around i did like this shirt i feel like this could be used in a lot of ways i love me a white shirt can't go wrong with a white shirt different types of white shirts so this was really cute um and i think i'll be able to style that really well in, in a lot of different ways and that was actually 9.99 and if you need me to put the proof in the pudding, bam, $9.99. So, the next thing I got, actually, I found me a little maxi dress. And it's white. 
and I would normally not ever, ever in my life buy me a white maxi dress. First of all, what you're not gonna do is do that. I'm not petite enough for a white maxi dress, so you will always see my spillage, my curves, my dents, my, you know, like underwear, like you're gonna see something, so I would never do that. But I got this because it's double lined. And I'm like, yes, finally someone gets it. It must be Kim Kardashian who got people paying attention now because, yeah, like who could wear that thin behind maxi dress? I can't do that. My mother raised me better. If you're gonna put it in white or like yellow, like them light colors, who can wear that? So I got this white maxi with like camisole, um, straps and they adjust so that's nice um i feel like because it's double line i could probably wear this without a bra or maybe just a little bit of boot tape for a little support but it's like full length double lined white cute you know it's nothing major but can definitely be cute on a nice summer day and this was 9.99 as well all right first cargo are these olive green you may, maybe these are hunter green. Mm, they're not that deep. I'd say olive hunter. But anyway, I got these green cargo pants. I love the color. I love how they mimic a denim cargo pant. Um, they have the straight leg. And then I absolutely love the drawstring type of situation on the waist and at the at the feet. So like if you wear it with tennis shoes or whatever the case may be, they have the right fit. It's giving you the right vibe. It's not doing too much. Or if you do want the straight leg to just be clean and straight, you can do that with heels, like whatever you want to do. I just love the versatility of it. I love the pocket situation. They are real pockets, but they do sit like on the side. I think that's cool. I love the metal hardware on it and the drawstring at the waist. Like who doesn't want that? Like I need it to come up over these hips and this booty, but then it needs to fit my waist and be flattering. So Absolutely love these. One of the many cargos I got this time, and this was $12.99. Okay, next up is another parachute cargo skirt, y'all. Y'all know in my last video, I looked up and I found me this like mint sage green um parachute skirt. Love her, love her life. She's a piece okay and i ended up finding a black one like what what so this skirt works for me because again it has the drawstring at the waist it has little pockets on the side the only difference from my last one to this one there's two differences this has a slit on the back like you know where your calves are i think that's gonna be really flattering for a woman in a skirt and like give it the right shape but it does not have the drawstring at the bottom so we'll see what type of shape it gives me it's black though and it has pockets and it's not too big so i think i'll be able to work it it's just not the exact same skirt i had last time which i love that skirt for those reasons it has drawstrings at the bottom and the top so that you can make it flattering to your body shape but I don't feel like this is going to lack extremely because of that. And I think with the slit on the back, it helps add to or help that, help resolve that if, if it is an issue. But I mean, a black cargo skirt for $5.99. I mean, how picky could I be? And it seems super breathable, like, Ugh, yeah, so that's another piece. Oh, these next ones. Uh, so you see, I have like really like neutral colors with the green, with the black, even my shirts are white. Baby, this little pop of color popped out at me, and y'all know I'm not scared of color at all whatsoever. So I saw these and I was like, oh, those would be really freaking cute, different, they have character because of their color. They're a cargo, but they also are like that sport, like your PE teacher sport material. Cause like the, the green ones are definitely more classic, like 
they can be dressed up they can be dressed down i'm not saying that these can't but the material mimics more of like sports street style wear so i got this i don't know what kind of blue this is so you can probably like see in the like the, you can probably see it visually how it's definitely like a different texture of the cargo pants and like they, they make that swishy sound um not anything annoying but you know a little swishy sound and then it actually comes with three drawstrings so it's like by the thighs at the knees and at the feet and a drawstring at the waist so you can definitely play with the style of these cargos whether they're a little bit more fitted whether they're a little bit more jogger like or just straight leg or like baggy um it has pockets on the i think it has it has pockets on the waist and has pockets on the legs and i just really fell in love with the color and i just thought that they were different cute summer appropriate dress up dress down i had to get them girl and these were 11.99 so taking a break from the pants i came across this shirt in a very similar blue they are not the same blue but they're similar enough to do like a monochromatic look <laughs> it's gonna eat so it's basically this bodysuit in this blue color it's like a shade lighter than the cargo pants so perfect like dimension between the two but very much like cohesive monochromatic and it's one of those kind of like high neck um high neck tank top ones you know what i'm talking about y'all see it y'all see it and i've actually been having a lot of luck finding different bodysuits in ross and double line bodysuits at that and like not too thin like sometimes thin is okay because the way that i plan to use this will be like weekend wear so i'm not looking to wear this at work but it has enough thickness to it that i could because who really wants to wear a bra when they wear a bodysuit? It's supposed to hold you in. It's supposed to just do the job. And when they're just thin, it's just like, where can I wear this? For me personally. So I can say that I've been having some really good luck finding good quality double line bodysuits at Ross. So when I see them, I try to pick them up because they are just really good basics. And they look so seamless. And you can match them with so much. And they get that chic vibe depending on like the sleeves. I have a cap sleeve one i have a high neck one now i have this one that is a high neck tank top one like really cute and so i got this on the clearance rack actually this was 4.49 yep that i'm excited about i love that like a monochromatic look in blue and what between the two that's five dollars and Twelve dollars, so I got a eighteen dollar outfit if included that. Hopefully they look good together, but yeah. All right, so I switched gears a bit because when I tell y'all they had so many cargos, I really could have went cargo crazy. Like especially the ones that aren't denim, they had so many, and I'm like, I love this. Like it's not denim, but it's still giving the same vibe as cargo denim, and they just. Are a little bit more versatile like you can be used in work the weekend dressed up dressed down like I could have went crazy but I did not but I did end up getting one cargo denim because I have been wanting black cargo denim jeans for a minute I got some from Ross before I didn't try them on and they were too tight so we got to redeem ourselves with this trip so I got these black cargo high-waisted denim pants with like a boyfriend cut so straight leg relaxed fit but you know made of denim but it's not even that hard denim it's definitely movable and breathable denim with the silver hardware on it and just seamless effortless not too much going on definitely gonna be used love a black pant what can i say it's just one of those things that you could have and like do a lot with especially like street style wise and i really got to get my sneaker game up like i really got to get my sneaker game up so that i can do more chill looks 
you know but if i go outside eight times out of ten i'm putting on some heels because like i'm not even a sandals girl for real so it's either cute sneakers or heels i don't really like sandals i don't or crocs oh i just diy me some crocs i don't know if y'all see that video before this one or not but i just diy me some like balenciaga inspired crocs and these would look cute with those. Mm -hmm. You know, nothing special, but definitely a great addition because I did not have anything like this. And these were, where's the price? So I just have to confirm with my receipt. It's gotta be this. It's gotta be that one. So these were twelve ninety nine. Yep. Okay, so the last couple items are some shirts that I found. Um, I've been on the hunt for some nice graphic tees because I realized I had phased out of my graphic tee phase, and then I'm like a little bit back into it sometimes and I just have like graffitis that are now pajamas or they're kind of faded or I'm wearing the same ones so I gotta like figure that out a little bit I came across one I didn't find a whole bunch because they that's what it is like the graffitis be stupid at least where I look for them like I'm just like yeah I could get it for the colors but what you saying on it and even the quality of the shirt, it's not giving. These are cotton. They're not polyester. They're not that made up material that businesses be selling these days. Like, I don't get it, so it don't be working for me. But I found me like a Bratz graphic tee, and I thought it was cute, and like, that's my childhood. So I grew up on, I had hella Bratz, okay? Me and my cousins, we had Bratz. One of my cousins had the Bratz airplane. What y'all know about that? yeah i had the brats twins the little baby twins when they started coming out with the kids and they was like chunky and bow leg i had those i had a little brats house like don't play with me my birthday christmas i'm getting brats mm, that girl had all the brats had everybody i had jada had i don't think i had chloe because why you know but i had jay <laughs> yasmin i had sasha um yeah nothing really like special but i did like the vintage effect of the shirt because i originally had a different graphic tee in my hand with the brats on it they looked different it was a little bit different colorway um and it was like a plain black shirt but i went with the vintage looking shirt versus just the plain black shirt i just thought i just thought to myself you might like this one better than just black so there's the girls, and this was $9.99. Okay, so we're pulling up the rear before I show y'all the additional item I got that I just couldn't pass up on. But my last item that I got was another bodysuit, but in this like nude color, and it's got a square top to the neckline, and um, it's a thong bodysuit. So gonna be very seamless under like white, anything like that, any pants really, cause who wants panty lines? And it has these like long sleeves, um, but just really pretty, like an effortless top in something that's not white, cause I do white a lot. I mean, in a different direction sometimes, cause like I be neglecting my new shoes that I have because I'll just wear my white ones. So I'm trying to like, you know, just give me a little variety so I can kind of pair things back with gold more per se than silver or wear brown versus black with the nude it kind of just the families if you know color and color and your brain works like that you know what i mean honestly this shirt is pretty breathable actually like on the the arms it's not double lined like the bodysuit part so it has like it's just like a little lighter in material same color same idea nothing like drastic like oh those look like two different things but for wear it is 
more breathable on the arms so that helps with me being in summer so this was also off the clearance rack and this was 49 yeah girl y'all already know how you girl come through you know what i'm saying and i i, I want to like brag but you know sometimes i only find like three things so sometimes i let y'all down but this time we did pretty good and i went like on a time limit so if i had stayed in there i probably would have like found more but honestly i think that happened on for a good reason because this was plenty. I did not need to get multiples of the same cargo. Like, just figure out which color you want and keep it pushing. I'm trying to be more intentional with purchasing because I like clothes. I love clothes. But, you know, you got to you got to be a big girl. You got to, like, think things through. You can't just be impulsive. Okay, so for the final of the haul to my little additional purchase, so in honor of the Met Gala, I um they always have his bags in Ross. And it kind of like makes me, it used to make me like question like, okay, like is Carl not that guy? Like why is he in Ross? You know what I'm saying? But they also be having like Betsy Johnson and like coach and stuff sometimes. Like just on like the designer rocks. Rocks. I'm human. What what the designer racks like Bessie be like for the public and then on the designer racks it'll be like coach Michael Kors, Tommy Hilfiger, Calvin Klein and Carl I'll see Carl like on the designer racks or like on the regular racks and it, I used to just be like well why is he there like why is he even in Ross like but his his accolades were just recognized on this Met Gala of this year so I was like very much in tune with Carl and like have a different view for him. And so when I saw this bag, I was like, that's cute. That's me. Let's get it. Cause it was, it was really affordable for a bag of this quality. So here's the bag. Like what? It's, oh. It's so pretty. This originally is $248. And I got this for $69.99. Like on some fluke shit. You know what I'm saying? Like I ain't going there looking for it. It's so well made. And the colors. And I like the pattern. It's not cheesy to me. It's cute. And then the freaking... um. The straps have this red interlocking and then the, the brass gold. Like, and it's the shape of like a Chanel bag. Bombastic side eye. So let's just start there. You already know, like, this is in the shape of a Chanel bag. Criminal offensive side eye. So it's just really freaking cute and well made. And then it has a little back pocket. And then the inside is red leather like ugh. girl girl it's the only purse i like that day and i love purses as you may have noticed i love purses and a lot of the time when i go on ross i see multiple that i like but this was the only bag that i liked so i got her she's so cute I'm gonna put her up on the wall and the girls better be nice to her and, you know, welcome her and make her feel welcome because she is. Um, so, yeah. This is so cute. So, this is my addition. So, we're going to subtract this from the money counter. Like, this doesn't count. That's just how I feel about it. But if it did count, I still only spent $166.52 for a whole bag on top of everything that I got. And not just any bag, like a bag. I don't know. It might just be me. I don't know. I guess. I, and if it is, I'll stand alone. I'll stand on it. I'll stand alone. Say what I say. I do what I do. 